Welcome to our lecture online. In this case, we're going to show you that parametric equations do not need to be unique. Starting with the equation y equals x squared divided by 8 minus 4, we're going to show you that you can get three different sets, or actually an infinite number of different sets of parametric equations. We're just going to show you three types, three sets, and we're going to have x equals t, x equals 2t, and x equals t minus 1. So you can see you first start out with an equation where x is a function of t, and then you find a corresponding equation where y will be a function of t, and that will then give you the set of parametric equations. So starting with x equals t, we're going to take our equation and replace every x by t, so this becomes y equals t squared divided by 8 minus 4, and this gives you the set of parametric equations when you start with x equals t. But what if x equals 2t? Well, then what you do is we replace every x by 2t in the equation, and we get y equals 2t quantity squared divided by 8 minus 4. So that means that y equals 4t squared divided by 8 minus 4, or y equals t squared divided by 2 minus 4. So that then pairs up with x equals 2t, and here you can see that this is a different set of parametric equations as the one here we have x equals t. Now going over here, again to show you that the, you could start with any function of t for the value of x. So now when we plug that in, we get y equals the quantity t minus 1 squared over 8 minus 4. So this becomes y equals t squared that would be minus 2t plus 1, all divided by 8, plus 4. Of course, we can simplify that even more, but if we leave it like that, let's see here. No, let's try this. We can say y equals 1 8 t squared minus 1 4 t. That would be plus 1 8 plus 4, for that would be plus 33 over 8. And so here, oop, combined with the equation, x equals t minus 1. So you can see that right away we have three different sets of parametric equations, each perfectly valid, each representing the original equation y equals x squared over 8 minus 4. And that's how it's done.